Hello everyone and welcome again. Today I've received two parcels. One of them, I assume it's gonna be this one, it should be some snails. And that one has a big surprise because there is a very rare and endangered species of live bearer from Mexico, from Presa de Coincio, if I pronounce it right. So yeah, let's get opening. Let's start with the snails. Let's see how they survive the postage. So they had a long trip to go. A couple of hundreds of miles. So yeah. Let's have a look. Okay. Quite robustly packed. What is this box? Yeah. Nice box for, for some snails. Can't see too much. Those are supposed to be mystery snails or Apple snails, however you call them. Yeah, it's a species quite hard to get here in the UK. This time I got lucky. My girlfriend is gonna get crazy about these because. She loves the apple snails and for her it's never too many. Hey, they all look alive. I've got 13 instead of 10 that I ordered so actually yeah, sort of a bonus. Nice. Okay, but now for the main part. The most important bit. Let's see the fish. Okay. As usual, nicely packed. Some information about Breathing bags. Okay. I already know it. It's not the first time I'm ordering fish from this supplier. By the way, if anyone is looking for a good supplier of fish in UK, just let me know. I'll pass you the information. Okay. And there they are. Neotoka Bilineata. Got a nice pair of these lovely fish. It's actually an endangered species in the wild. So it's gonna be very fun and very important to start breeding them. Put them in a plastic container. They're probably still a bit of scared. 
Uh, yeah, in a while this should be fine. Not an expert on these, but I hope it is a pair. For me, they, they look almost identical. But yeah, we'll see. Maybe if any of you has some experience with these fish, you could actually let me know. What are your your thoughts about this? Maybe you know more about it. Maybe you know if it's a male and a female, or is it two females? Okay. Let's get acclimating them. For most of my fish, I'm going to be using a drip acclimation method. So I'm using a paper clip like this. I'm just going to drag the airline tubing through it. Tie a knot. from my micropressilia fish tank so as you can see everything has been good so yeah so plus a new fish tank waiting for setting up okay let's wait for them to acclimate Okay, so the acclimation is done. It's time to let the fish in. So I will be adding them to the microperceria tank at the moment. <clears throat> Just a temporary measure because the microperecilia female is in here. She's supposed to give birth quite soon. So yeah, so since the male is on his own in this tank, I think it's gonna be quite good to put the new focus uh, together with him. Okay, so let's put the fish inside. I can't say they look very healthy, but it is what I got. Yeah, hopefully they will feel better very soon. I'm gonna feed them live Daphne in about a few minutes. So yeah. Hopefully they will get better very soon, yeah. So yeah, if you did like the video, please subscribe. And let me know if you know anything about these fish because all the information is going to be needed. And yeah, until next time. See ya.